We have a place where all forms with detailed information entered and submitted by the customer can be stored, including the errors record when the form submission failed, for example. In order to enable this functionality, you need to add one more post-submit action to your form, which is called Save Form Record. The action settings here are pretty basic as for now. This toggle allows you to store the IP address and other request headers such as the application, operating system and or version of the requesting user agent. So, once the action is added to the form and the form is submitted on the front end, you will see the information of it appear in your dashboard in the JetForm Builder form records page. Here you can mark it as viewed, not viewed, or delete it. Filter the info by the forms, if you have a couple of them on your site, and check out the detailed information about each request if needed. So, over here you'll find the names of the fields, the values entered by the customer, and the field types, as well as some general values with user agent info, action logs, and error logs if there were any. First thing to remember when using this option is that it will not, like under any circumstances, it will not save the text fields of the type password, which is pretty obvious. And second, in order to save the errors data, you need to have the dev mode enabled on your site. And you can do that by adding the following filter to your functions PHP file.